The Railway Industry Association is almost as old as the railway itself and could be one of the oldest trade bodies in the world. It was established as the Locomotive Manufacturers Association in 1874 to protect the interests of locomotive builders. And as the industry and technology has changed, the association has continued to be the voice of the UK's rail supply community. And 145 years on, RIA's primary focus remains very similar to when it was first set up, to develop a bigger and better national rail sector for the benefit of the whole UK. At its most recent annual conference, and at a time of great change within the wider industry, it was clear that voice is needed now as much as ever. We have two sides to what we do, the content side of what we do, whether that's policy or lobbying or technical innovation, exports work. But the other side of it, which is what trade associations, the good ones should do, and that's bring people together. I think it's a hugely exciting time to be in rail. My role takes me around the world and what I see is rail investment happening, not just here in the UK, but in virtually every country, be it freight, be it heavy rail, be it light rail and mass transit. The opportunities for British engineering are huge and we really must take advantage of that. I think the biggest challenge is the size of the task. You know, we have an ageing infrastructure and increasingly more demand, and we're going to come up with some, have to come up with some very smart solutions to go and solve those problems against the backdrop of, I think, everybody's entitled to expect more for less. There's a huge wave of technological innovation that needs to come into our industry. We are still in some parts behind the curve compared to comparable modes. I think there's a bow wave of digitisation coming, we're already seeing it, but we really need to exploit that to maximum benefit and the supply chain have a huge role to play in that. There are so many opportunities to deliver improvements for passengers and freight users. I mean, really, there are so many things within our gift that we can change. If we really embrace that passenger-centric frame of mind, I think there are things we can be doing and, and how great to be starting to deliver you know changes that people can see on the ground. It's really about what RIA does in terms of having that collective voice for the industry and in a time when we need more people trained with the right skills, at a time whenever the industry needs to grow, I think RIA's voice is incredibly important. A generation ago the railway fragmented when it was privatised, splintered into many parts. It's essential to have organisations like the Railway Industry Association that can take a bigger picture, that can step back, that can represent myriad suppliers and contractors and organisations working in the railway so that they're all on the same page. I joined the rail industry about two years ago officially with the Railway Industry Association and it was quite a different move but it's given me so many opportunities. I think they do a really good job in corralling the uh, supply uh, families uh, together in, in a, in, under a sort of a common voice and uh, I've been proud to be a director of RIA uh, for several years now and um, I'm very pleased to say that I think they do some really good work. It's bringing together industry professionals. We've been talking today about diversity and inclusion, so we've got an opportunity there to make sure the, the railway network is much more inclusive. The supply network to the rail industry is everything, and an organisation like RIA that's able to bring uh, different organisations together to allow for collaboration, but also to, to allow for key messages to come into organisations like ourselves is really important to ensure that we innovate in a way that's going to lead to success for the future. Well, from my perspective, the convening power of RIA is really important. Talk is work, after all, and so events, conferences where we're talking about the big issues which are hitting us in the industry and the solutions we need to develop is absolutely critical and RIA does a great job, so here's the next 145 years. 145 years! Wow! What an achievement! Congratulations, Railway Industry Association. Happy anniversary, Rear, and congratulations on your 145 years of success. We look forward to uh, future success and keep making the case for the rail supply chain in our important industry. I'd like to congratulate the Railway Industry Association on 145 years, and I look forward to working with Rear for many years to come.
congratulations to Ria on 145 years of existence. Uh, it's always fantastic to work with you, and I wish you 145 years more of uh, successful delivery uh, for all your membership. The supply chain uh, for the rail sector in Britain does an absolutely fantastic job, and I'm a huge believer in the power of trade associations in presenting to clients like myself, but also the governments, uh, the case for further investment and uh, collaboration with the supply chain. And I think RIA does a brilliant job at that. Very happy anniversary to RIA on its first 145 years. You do a great deal of good for the industry and we look forward to working with you in the future. It's a remarkable achievement and they've added so much value over the years. I used to run the underground that was 153 years old, the world's oldest metro. So, so having an industry association with that length of time is just absolutely remarkable. Congratulations, Ria, on your 145th anniversary. You do play a key role uh, in the industry, bringing suppliers together and helping us all become better consistently for the future. Happy anniversary to everyone at the Railway Industry Association. You guys are doing an incredible job and thank you for all the positive media that you've brought to our industry because we deserve that recognition. The hard-working men and women in Orange and not in Orange like myself um, deserve that. So thank you so much. Congratulations to Ria on your 145th anniversary. I think you did a great job of bringing the rail industry in Britain together and here's the next 145 years. Congratulations to uh, Ria for your 145th anniversary uh, and keep doing the great work and we look forward to seeing what brings uh, Ria in the future. We've now reached our 145th birthday and we start embark on the next 145 years. Please do come and join us if you're not a member already. This is where you get your issues dealt with but you also have lots of fun dealing with lots of people, lots of networking and uh, if you want to grow your business, Ria can help you make a bigger and better rail supply sector.